Hello and welcome back ladies and gentlemen, Force here with another update video. This is for the week of November 19th to the 25th. Here we'll be talking about new releases this week as well as planned content for the channel. Let's begin though with discussion of this week's new releases of which there were quite a few. On Monday we saw the release of Little Inferno which is a game that has you burning stuff in a fireplace. I covered this in a first 40 and yeah, I thought it was pretty fun. It was a pretty interesting game, definitely very different uh, from a lot of games that we're used to playing. It's it's not an action game, it's not a shooter, it's not an RPG, it's not an RTS. It's, lit it's literally like a story. Uh, it's an interactive story. You burn stuff in a fireplace and there's this whole, this whole, uh, this whole story arc that you go through throughout the process of the game. The game itself is only supposed to last about three hours. But it's supposed to tell a pretty touching story, so uh, check out the first 40 if you might be interested, and if you like what you see, well, check out the game. It's only 15 bucks. Uh, also on Monday, we saw the release of Sonic Adventure 2, another Sonic game for those Sonic fans. Tuesday, lots of new games. Of course, Assassin's Creed 3 came to the PC. Uh, here's the deal with this game. I will be playing it, but uh, because of the holiday coming up this week, I'm not going to get a chance to get around to it to either this weekend or early next week, and because of that, I'm really not sure how much video coverage I'm even going to do. Uh, maybe I can come out with their first 40, but it almost seems pointless because the game's been on console for so long, and by the time I even make a video on the PC, most people who are interested have probably already played it. So it's kind of tough. You know, a lot of times with these new releases, I try to do my video coverage the day it comes out or the day after so that it's pertinent and that people who are interested in the game can be like, all right, well, I saw this 40 minutes of gameplay. looks good. Let me go buy it. Or I don't like it. Not going to pick it up. Um, but I guess if I do end up getting it like I think I'm going to and I'm going to play it, I might as well do something about it. So you might see a video on Assassin's Creed 3. Still a little bit of wishy-washy about that. Uh, Borderlands 2 got some DLC, Mr. Torque's Campaign of Carnage, which was released on Tuesday. Uh, just some more Borderlands 2 action. I haven't played the game since the last video I did covering the prior DLC, which was the Pirate's Booty thing. In fact, I think I may have uninstalled Borderlands 2, not because I didn't like it, but because I've got so many games on my computer as is, and I'm really not sure if I'm going to get around to this. I'm also not sure if I'm going to get around to this other new release, Family Guy, back to the multiverse, a Family Guy game. Sounds funny. I'm not that interested. Uh, Hitman Absolution came out on Tuesday as well. This is, of course, the stealth action game, the fifth one in the Hitman series from IO Interactive. I did a first 40. I think the game is a lot of fun. I don't really know what all the fuss is about. You know, it's been so polarized, the opinion on this title. Some people are saying it's absolutely fantastic. Some people are saying they hate it. I guess it really comes down to how your feelings are on prior games and the differences between, say, Blood Money and this title. You know, prior games aside, I liked... I've liked what I played. I did the first 40 video, and beyond that, I played for a good three hours so far of the campaign, and I, I think it's fun. I haven't even touched, uh, I haven't even touched Sniper Challenge. I haven't touched the Contracts mode either, and so far, I think it's worth my money. You know, for $50, uh, it's a it's a pretty entertaining stealth action game. And again, prior installments of Hitman aside. I thought it was good. You can check out the first 40 to decide for yourself and uh, get yourself a better opinion on the title. Planet Side 2 came out on Tuesday. Please don't get me started on this game. <laughs> here's, the, here's the deal. Like I said before, I just haven't had the time to sit down and play this game for an extended period of time, which is what I think is necessary to cover it and actually know what the hell I'm talking about. And so the game is here. I still haven't covered it. I, again, can't make any promises if it's going to happen or not. I, you know, I think it's really interesting. I think the game's got a lot of good concepts. It's an MMO shooter, faction-based, where everyone's vying for, vying for control of this land. And, you know, you take basically, I'll call them like towers. I'm sure there's an exact name. But you take control of these random command centers or towers or whatever, and you get control of the zone. That gives your side resources. It's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool game. If you're interested, definitely look at video coverage. I know Total Biscuit did a bunch of stuff, and I guarantee there's also tons of other coverage by other people. So give it a look. I think it's good, and because I haven't covered it doesn't mean I don't like it or that I'm not interested. It's just been a matter of time. Scribblenauts Unlimited came out on Tuesday, and I believe that wraps up all of the Tuesday releases. And then on Wednesday, we saw the fifth episode of Season 1 of Telltale Games The Walking Dead. As of this recording, I have got the entire episode finished. Uh, it's in two parts. The first part's like 45 minutes long or so, and the second part's around 50 to 60 minutes long. And that's the end of it. That's the end of Season 1. Heart-wrenching. 
absolutely heart-wrenching. Really can't wait for you guys to see uh, this two-part of episode five. Uh, I'll be getting part number one up this evening, and hopefully part two will be up tomorrow, but it's all recorded. It should be set to go unless I get some random-ass screwy thing. Like, this is what happened last time. I finished everything, and then there was a corrupt file. Now, I don't think I'll have to deal with that, but who knows? Maybe it'll happen. I'm really keeping my fingers crossed that this goes through smoothly, though, and that I don't have to try to re-record it or anything like that. All right, so let's also talk about the rest of this week here. Uh, Those are the new releases. That's my planned coverage of the new releases. Uh, In terms of what's going on, well, uh, I'm sure you've noticed there was no force feed yesterday. I will be coming out with a force feed today, uh, so long as everything goes according to plan. I am planning to do that right after this. And... Thursday and Friday, no go. Uh, Thursday, of course, if you live in the States, you'll know that Thanksgiving is celebrated on that day, and that's what I'll be doing. I'll be going to visit my family, spending time with everyone, and eating food, and that should be a lot of fun. And also on Friday, oh God, shoot me now. (laughs) Friday is known as Black Friday uh, for the reason that there's a lot of sales that occur, and my girlfriend wants me to go shopping. So that's what I'll be doing. And you know, I guess the, I guess the truth of the matter is that it's a great way to save money on things that I'm going to purchase anyways. For example, for Christmas that's coming up, and that's our planned. I, I'm just trying to talk myself into this. I'm not looking forward to going shopping on Black Friday, but it's what I'm going to do because I care. And sometimes you have to do things you don't want to do when you're in a relationship. Isn't that the truth? Uh, so that's what's happening on Thursday and Friday. Now, as you can imagine, Thanksgiving won't be available. Friday won't be available for two reasons. Not only because I'll be shopping all day, woohoo, but also because I'm going to be a good four hours away from my house uh, because my family lives far south of where I currently am. So as a result, won't be working on Thursday or Friday. However, good news is that I'm coming back on Saturday and Sunday for the specific reason of working to make up for Thursday and Friday. So even though I won't be working on Thursday and Friday, I will be coming back Saturday, working all through the day and working most of Sunday to try to make up for some of that missed content. And I will be doing a force feed at least one of those two days, if not both. So that's what's going on uh, for the rest of this week and for this weekend. Also, let me just touch on today's content. Uh, So I'm going to be trying to do the force feed after this. We have this update video. I recorded a great SC2 match, the two parts of the Walking Dead episode episode five and then also if you haven't seen it yet i did a smite video covering the brand new god bacchus the god of wine i wrecked some face so watch that if you want to see some smite ownage i uh yeah i totally owned it up and i apologize that i didn't mention this in the beginning of the video uh, but if you're still wondering if you still don't know gameplay in the background is of course from hitman absolution and i think that's going to do it for this update video really not uh, much else for me to tell you nothing really crazy going on in my personal life. Oh, I started playing the guitar again. Whoopee. Uh, It's been a long time since I sat down with my guitar and uh, strung out some tunes. And it's, yeah, it's bringing back some memories. I'm having a good time. It's a good way for me to relax. I get so stressed throughout the work day. Uh, Sometimes what I'll do is while I'm recording, if I keep messing up or something, I'll just chill out and strum some notes on the guitar. And that kind of relaxes me a bit and gets me back into the mood. All right, guys, that's enough of that. Thanks uh, so much for watching this update video for the week of November 19th to the 25th. As I said, a bunch of new releases. I'll be covering a handful of them. Uh, Won't be working on Thursday and Friday, but we'll be back this weekend to make some more content. Thanks again. If you like the content, please subscribe. And as always, keep watching and keep owning.